What's up, everybody? It's Dave from Betsum.com. I'm going to go over a few of my uh, NBA daily fantasy uh, plays, some of the core guys I like for uh, tonight on January 20th, 2016. Um, I don't really see many games that I like, so I'm not going to be betting tonight, uh, although I do semi like the Blazers, uh, plus two or two and a half if you can find it. Uh, I'm not sure if I like it enough to um, to bet it, though. So, so on to the... Uh, some of the plays, um, we got Damian Lillard here at point guard. He's been carrying me this year, him and Butler, and they're both playing tonight, so I'm loving it. Uh, Lillard has another tough OPRK, and um, I've been taking him in those spots, and uh, it has paid off to the point where he's gotten some of his biggest games with tough OPRKs, and he's been like 9% owned, uh, which is much less than some of those other top guys for that price. So he's a little cheaper than... Um, some of the Russell Westbrooks in the world and Stephen Curry's, but he could still go off for 60, and he's always less owned. So I really like him again tonight. Uh, Marcus Smart has been a super solid value play the last few games. Uh, he put up 51 the, uh, a few nights ago, uh, which is pretty sweet. Uh, he should continue to be a great value uh, at this price, and Toronto is actually semi-weak versus that point guard position, uh, OPRK-wise. Donald Sloan at 4,800. He's been seeing around 30 minutes a game lately and scoring over a point a minute uh, the last uh, 10 games. So he's a pretty good, uh, pretty great price for that kind of uh, minutes production ratio um, if he can keep that up. So um, I'll definitely be gambling on him a little bit tonight. I like his value. Jimmy Butler, as I said before, he's been huge this year. Uh, he seems to only be getting better as the season progresses. I mean, scoring 81 fantasy points a few nights ago is unbelievable. Um, this should be a fast-paced, high-scoring game versus Golden State, and I frankly can't wait for it. I love Jimmy Butler um, tonight versus that defense uh, with that point total. At small forward, uh, Tobias Harris for 6,100. Um, I mean, he get, he plays 38 minutes and uh, every game, and he scores about 30 fantasy points per game. A lot of those Orlando guys uh, seem to have high minutes and low points, but... Um, he's super consistent, and he has a really good matchup tonight versus uh, the 76ers. On the flip side of that game, we have Covington. Um, he's uh, 5,800. Uh, his minutes are clearly increasing uh, right now uh, by a pretty decent amount, and he's been playing over 30 minutes uh, lately. If he can get a little more production, then he's going to be a steal at this price, but um, I do like him as a sneak play tonight. Patrick Patterson, 4,400. I really like him as a um, uh, value play uh, the last few games and tonight. Uh, his minutes have gone from uh, about 20 to 22, from like 30 to 34 uh, last 10 games. So he's clearly on the rise right now, and the coach is playing him. And he's got a, a pretty favorable matchup um, versus Toronto, who's 27th versus the power forward position. Uh, Zaza Pachulia, 6,200. Um, he's scored 32 to 40 in eight of his last 10. Um, and aside from one game where he only played 20 minutes versus the Spurs in a blowout, uh, he's just been uh, super consistent, putting up great points. And that's with shooting the ball uh, relatively poorly during that whole span. He's um, been able to rack up a lot of rebounds, 15 boards plus, um, and that's huge for his fantasy value. Uh, if he can start knocking down some shots, uh, he'll be. Uh, just a fantastic price for 6200 and he's got a pretty good matchup tonight versus the Timberwolves, who are 24th first to center. So those are a few of uh, my core plays tonight. Um, hope you guys win some money. Good luck, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, Betsum.com.